Yes, you are. You're such a little gray. You're such a little gray. We gotta set this right, Grace. Put the fighting spirit back in the American people. Ignite a revolution. Shit. We've been fighting every motherfucking day, Blazkowicz. White America, though? They done packed up and given in. See, I guess they don't have the fighting spirit no more. Nah, they just do whatever the fucking Fuhrer tells them to do. That's baloney. They want to fight the Nazis just as much as we do. All they need is for someone to show them how. You know who's running the South after the Nazis took over? The Ku Klux motherfucking Klan, am I right? That's it. So what you gonna do? You gonna go down there and hold hands with them and build bridges and persuade them to join our cause? Get your head out your ass, Blazkowicz. Forget about the turncoats. Focus on the grassroots. I'm running on empty. Don't know how much time I got. Can't even stand up on my own accord no more. I've seen worse. Maybe you're right. Maybe the American people grew comfortable living under tyranny. Maybe the Nazis will still be running the show after I kick the bucket. Sister Grace, always right, brother. I learned that the hard way. I don't know. But I know this. You take freedom away from the American people, you're playing with fire. And I intend to pour some gasoline. People gotta know they don't have to take this shit no more. Nothing else, that's what I'm gonna do before I go. See, that's what I'm talking about, Blaskowitz. You wanna strike fear in the Nazis? You wanna hit them hard for all to see? You wanna cause some real motherfucking havoc? Well, then you come to the right woman. So if you still got some Nazi fighting, killing skills up in you, then guess what? I got a plan that's gonna send shockwaves throughout the nation. Oh, shit. Is this the one where I go home to Roswell? Show you right. <laughs> What do you think about this, man, Mike? I think I got you now, my little goylem. Thanks, Hoss. I don't know, Maxilla. So this is where all the decisions are made. Huh. We're gonna need a room to sleep nearby. This one looks empty. Super Spash! Hey, Englishman. I'm gonna need a new home for my people. Power outlets, radio room access, and a can. You got it? Please. Say what? Please, you ask for something, you say please, and don't fucking call me Englishman. Okay, you wanna step to me, motherfucker, you wanna get shit done. Cause I'm gang either way. Don't, don't mind that. Absolutely no control over the thing. Happy to oblige. What's up, boss? We bunking in here. Oh, you got it, sister. All right. Listen up, brothers and sisters. The, uh, touchy Englishman is gonna show you where to set up shop. After that, I want you to look around. Find a place to bunk and get to know the boat folk. And hey, don't start no shit. But don't take none either. Okay, now. Well, what the kind lady said. Follow me. You got nukes on this boat? Yes, we do. There's a stockpile of nuclear warheads downstairs in Section F. We need to get our hands on one of those. But we've sealed up the entrance to Section F. Because it's been flooded since the attack. Last minute, you know how to swim? Yep. Maybe this isn't bad. What the fuck is this? I said, what the fuck is this, man? Is this a working toilet I see before me, handled toward my hand? Yes. Yes, this toilet can handle all sorts of waste, feces, urine, vomit, as you name it. Do you have ass wipe? If by that you mean toilet paper, yes. yes. Of course, we need to mind our rations a little bit, but uh, oh. there's ass wipe in oh, there. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Yes. Oh, my sweet God in heaven. A working mother flushing toilet. I never thought I'd see the day. It's just, um, okay. Okay, I'm just gonna be in here for a minute. Good luck. What is this? Don't flog it! You think you're smart, huh? How about... Yeah. Make sure. 
No, no. Sauce. Check my head. Max. No. Max. No. Max. No. Max. No. Max. No. Max. No, you can't be, you stupid toilet. 